Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of M&A Mystery Tours. Now we're sort of halfway or going to Victoria, but we thought we'd stop at a cemetery called the Bedford Cemetery. Now I'm gonna go through here um, and see what, uh, see what we can see, shall we? All right, a uh, bit of a long grass, so it's like snake territory, guys. <laughs> so yeah, got to be careful of the snakes. Uh, so yeah, I thought I'd have a break from driving. I've been driving for a little while now. Um, so I have a break, have a stop and check out this small cemetery um, yeah okay I'm in the Bedford Cemetery there we go Definitely snake territory, so just got to be careful. Ooh. Another room. There we go. Can't read what's on there. Whoop. Uh, this one might be a short one, guys. <clears throat> James Scott Lord and something like L O U D O N died at Cook's Plains, Cook's Plains, August fifteenth, nineteen oh six age 88 years wow well there you go this one has no headstone on it oh, wow <laughs> Stupid. Okay. Mm -hmm. Can't read that one either. There's one over Punished. here. And I think that's it, guys, for the looks of it. It's just a small, small one. Plus, I just wanted to keep you updated, guys, which I will be doing. Um, keep you up, yeah, keep you update on how we're going and stuff. Uh, heading towards Victoria. So... Yeah. So, by the looks of it, that's it for for now. Anyway. <laughs> Must have been a rubbish dump or something over there because I can see a caravan and old, very old caravan over there. Guys. 
Uh, yeah, that's all there is. And that the rest of it could be unmarked as well, which is high in the grass there, which I don't want to walk around in anyway. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, that's it for this one. Trap. So we'll see you on the next one. Um, on the next cemetery, on the way through to uh, Victoria, and um, we'll see you then. Ciao for now, guys. Ciao for now, guys. Hi guys and welcome to another episode of MA History Tours. Now we're at the um, cemetery, that cemetery, <laughs> and um, yeah, let's go check things out here and have a bit of a look around because there is a big wall here. So yeah, let's go have a look. Um, here's some information. This is the K Y B Y B O L I T E station. So yeah, there's a, got a little bit of information there, guys. A little information, and check out these gates. I just opened um, the gate. Look at this wall. How cool is that? Wow. Alright, let's go in and have a look, see guys. And there's high grass here, but think the snakes are out in, the, in this cold weather. Uh, Exactly the same as the front. <sighs> there we go. And look at that. Wow. And that one there's been broken. And they've been broken there. Which is Mary and uh, Alfred. Here, 2nd of December 1863, died in 15th of November 1949. Okay. Look at this. That is huge. Wow. <laughs> uh, all I can see is James A. F. F. L. E. C. K. William, uh, same last name, A double F L E C K. And this one right here, David Alexander, Ale Alexander, 
uh, Fairlay, born at here, born here, 9th of May 1883, died 30th of August 1884. So yeah, I'd just like to say hello to the spirits that's here. Um, I might do an S box session here, guys. S box. Scanning. FM. Okay. I just want to find out if there's any spirits here that's lingering in this cemetery. In the middle here. My name is Mark. rest of it, there's no other grain that I can see, unless they're unmarked, they here, I'm not a hundred percent sure, um, yeah, right there. Oop. oh it's just a bunch of rocks, <laughs>
that's it. If you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up. Comment down below. Let me know what you think um, of this one. And uh, subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, M&A Mystery Tours. Also, head over to The Intrepids. Go over to her channel. Check her out. Check out her videos. They're quite good. Uh, yeah, and uh, enjoy her videos and what she puts up. And um, we will catch you later on, on the next video. Okay? Alright, ciao for now, guys. I do. Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of M&A Mystery Tours. Now we're just coming home from Victoria. Um, yeah, and um, come across this cemetery. It's called the Tintanara Cemetery. So let's go check things out, shall we? Let's do it. Alrighty, guys. Ooh. Where do we start? Um, Alright. I'll come across over here. Yeah, there's a few new ones about here and old ones. So I want to go across. Touch. Um, where the old ones are, I suppose. That one's a bit different, isn't it? On a major rock, big rock, I should say. <clears throat> Alice M-A-U-D well, yeah. Beloved wife of Fred Died 6th of December 1966 Aged 77 years In God's care Rest in peace I need to go oh, You can go if you want to Follow me. Got your angel. And that's the new one just there, which is quite nice, very nice headstone. Looks like we've got the new one. All the new ones are over there, guys. All the brand newies. So I might stick to here. Because it's pretty old here. Thirst. nice and warm which is good uh, who we have here we have Stephen Tamplin Kings died 4th of May 1956 aged 68 years wow. rest in peace inside 
outside actually. Why is that going off? The only iron fence I can see is the gates and stuff, but that's a bit far. This one here is a new headstone on that one guys. And what's the dates on there? 1965, age 43 years. Okay. Lorna, Lorna Joyce. Okay, rest in peace, Lorna. Nineteen forty-eight. I can't sound that's a pretty long name there. Wow. Hell. This looks alright, doesn't it? <laughs> Just this area around here. And what's in this one? In the loving memory of Albert E. North, Northcott. First AIF. Died 27th of August 1961. Age 68 years. Diane. Lest we forget. Thank you for your service. Rest in peace. Wow. And over here we have the ashes as well. All the ashes and stuff. Ashes. All their ashes are behind that plaque. Oh, that's pretty cool. Um, might just do a S box session. S box. Scanning um, FM. Let's see if anyone wants to. Yeah. Okay, and it's very cool like the time to say hello. In the loving memory of Henry Reverse, Reverse, beloved husband of Doris, passed away 1st of October 1969, age 68 years. Also, Doris E R N S T I N E. Beloved wife of above passed away 19th of June 1993, age 85 years. Alright, nothing's popping through on there, but if you did speak through, thank you. Joseph Stanley T. 
TW ELF tree the loved husband of Marvis passed away 15th of June 1970 aged 66 years also Marvis Lillian loved wife of Stan please uh, pass away 16th of August 1975 aged 60 years loved father and mother of Peter Spencer and Vivling V I V I E double N E I haven't been across here on this one. Nice little cross. I meant it. Okay. Simpson. And also my favourite flower. Rest, lest we forget. Uh -huh. Hidden. Yeah, it's, it's brand new as well. Most of these are brand new. Open it. I don't want to. And now it just starts all over again. memory of Elizabeth Jesse Hextall died May 25th 1955 age 63 rest in peace move it I am moving it Bark crunching. <laughs> and so that's all the brand newies, more modern headstones, all there. I don't really want to do those, but I thought I'll show you guys all the new ones. There. I wonder why that's going off. Yeah, I'm not quite sure why that's going off. But yeah, that's all your new ones, guys. The new ones there, which I won't do. 
Yes, it's okay to go up and read the headstones, but you don't want to disrespect them. I remember. So I hope you enjoyed this one, uh, this cemetery. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, m &A Mystery Tours. Comment below. Um, yep, yeah, please subscribe. Thumbs up. Always thumbs up. And we shall catch you later on. So ciao for now, guys. Ciao for now. And we'll catch you very soon. Shh.